Hey, welcome to episode of Chad's Beer Reviews. If you saw my latest short, you know that I got my new Tavor crate in. And this is one of the beers that was in there. This is from New Image Brewing Levels 2.2 Thiolized IPA with Phantasm. No idea what that means, but the label looks pretty cool. It looks like a Zelda, you know, video game or whatever. And they didn't say uh, the ingredients on here, although some of the stuff's kind of wacky, like Bodybuilder, <laughs> Southern Cross Plasma... So get it into the Spiegel IBA, IPA glass, I should say. And it's a, you know, pretty standard IPA, kind of a... Although this is a little more yellow than most IPAs. Um, it's not a haze bomb like some of the New England ones these days. But you get a nice, you know, white froth on there. Let's give it a whiff. Oh, wow. That is just straight up, like, tangerine juice. <laughs> um... Yeah, it's like to me, it's like tangerine or blood orange, something like that. This is really juicy smelling. By the way, this is only 6.5 ABV, so it's like a single IPA. Um, yeah, so no alcohol presence here, none. Uh, I'm trying to, I'm trying to pick up like some base malt, but you know, it's you don't tend to get them in American IPAs. You know, like just maybe a slight toast or something, but otherwise it's usually just standard two row and you know they just let the hops do the rest of the work. So let's dive in here. Cheers. Hmm. Yeah, um it definitely tastes I would say it tastes slightly better. Or sorry, it smells slightly better than it tastes. Because it, it just smells of like, you know, like I said, tangerine, blood orange, you know, like almost like a juicy or candy kind of aroma. And like those same flavors come through in the palate. Oddly enough, it is not that bitter. I guess you could probably, maybe they're going for a New England IPA. Because the thing with New England IPAs is that they tend to be really hoppy, like huge dry hop aroma. And more about like the hop flavor, and not so much the um, the bitterness. Theols are highly impactful aromatic compounds that can evoke intense tropical citrus character, reminiscent of juicy passion fruit, pink guava, and freshly zested grapefruit peel. The term theolized refers to our engineered yeast strains that have the ability to biotransform the theol precursors found in malt hops and grape derived products into free theols. Brewers can unleash these previously inaccessible tropical aromas in their beers simply by switching to theolized yeast strain. See, they incepted it into my head. Because now, like, pretty much all I can taste is, like, passion fruit and guava. I mean, yeah, there's the tangerine or orange citrusy kind of flavor. I would not call it grapefruit. Usually when you have a grapefruit flavor in IPA, it's, like, super bitter. And this beer is not that bitter at all. In fact, I wouldn't even really call it an IPA. To me, it's more like a pale ale. Um, you know, just... I, I put the IBUs at, like, 20 to 30. I will say um, the flavors there are nice. And, uh, yeah, whatever that theolized thing is, it's definitely bringing out the, the tropical uh, flavors. It is, um, it is a little simple, though. That's, like, my, kind of my only complaint about this is, like, it's... It drinks like a glass of like your breakfast juice, like, you know, like you'd have for brunch or, you know, like a mimosa or whatever. Um, so as far as that goes, yeah, it's a really tasty, kind of juicy flavor, but without the hot bitterness. And actually, I, I want the hot bitterness. So it's kind of like messing with my head because I'm going into this smelling huge hop aroma and then I'm like tasting the hop flavor but i'm not getting the bitterness i feel like something's missing there so that's why one of the reasons i'm not a huge new england ipa fan mouth feel on this is really light like um i mean you think this would be like at least medium medium full to me it strikes me as medium light almost almost light but i don't think i would go that far i mean it's not like bud light carbonation is moderate um it's it's not like super champagne effervescent, but it's not you know like an imperial stout where it's like just barely carbonated. You know this is you know, it has a nice moderate carbonation amount to it, 
and like medium light mouthfeel. Real, real easy to drink. I will say I would actually call this like legit refreshing. But it's just it's lacking the the IBUs. I want the I want the IBUs. Come on, give me the IBUs. I like the the hop aroma. I like the hop flavor. It's missing the IBUs, and like a little like you know base malt character would be nice. But you know, I don't drink my IPAs looking for base malt. And if you want that, drink an English IPA or something, or like some real old school East Coast IPA. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so this is good. It's not it's not great. Um, the, the the can art is pretty cool though um so as far as score for the new image levels 2.2 by the way i was when i was on untapped there is a 2.0 um this is i think it's like a three and a half tops i can even drop it down i can go in as low as like three three and a quarter three and a half something like that check my untapped check my instagram and you'll see my my final score um I mean, I like it. Don't get me wrong. It's it's tasty. It's fun to drink. It's just, for me, it's a little lacking in what I want in an IPA. But as always, like I said, you put a, a Nintendo-style can label on there, and I will definitely buy it. So um, this is going right on in my collection with other cool can labels. Do you guys can't collect beer bottle or beer can labels or the cans or bottles themselves? Let me know in the comments. All right, so if you watch all the way in, you are awesome. By the way, I got this on Tavor. Link in the description below. Use my code. You're going to get $10 off your first purchase. And let them know that I sent you. So thanks for watching, and I will see you guys real soon. All right, cheers. Somebody brewed it. Chad just reviewed it. Thanks for watching Chad's beer. Trust me, the next episode will be a lot better.